community, and we encountered Bunchy Carter. He had been head of the Slawsons, which was a street gang that evaporated like all of the rest of them after the 65 uprising in L.A. when all of the tension and frustration got out everybody's system and black-on-black crime dropped to almost zero. I think there were only two black-on-black homicides in 18 months. There were no burglaries, no robberies, no rapes. That was in 1968, wasn't it? No, this was, I'm talking about after the wire. Oh, yeah, after, yeah. 566, you know, there's nothing going wrong in the black community. And LAPD wouldn't come in there unless they were riding 5D. I want to, I want you to corroborate a story with me that real quick, Dr. Judge, and stay on this subject. Uh, Judge, my uncle was a police officer in 1967 here in L.A. And he talked about those years when there was basically no crime between 66 and 68. And he talked about after the riots, a lot of the LAPD who was in South Central in Watts, the white boys that was messing things up, they shipped them out to the valley and then brought yeah, in a whole bunch did, of brothers down here to South Central just, L.A. They did just exactly that. So all right, cool. Was, so you people, I, when I tell that story, the judge just corroborated it for me. All y'all future listeners, y'all know I ain't bullshitting when I tell that story now. Go ahead, judge. That's absolute truth. And things improved. Now, at this point, we started bringing in 